Hey guys and girls and welcome to today's Python tutorial, fun with flags. So we're going to have a look at the uh, Python turtle to draw um, uh, a well-known flag. So the first thing we're going to do is from turtle and we're going to import uh, everything, so import star. And then what we're going to do is we're going to draw, start to draw our flag. So we're going to say uh, color black is going to equal black. And then we're going to start to um, draw with that color. So what we're going to do is we're going to begin fill. And this will allow us to fill in a um, whatever we draw. So we're going to begin fill. I'm going to go forward 180. 180. We're then going to turn right 90. And then we shall go forward 40. Okay, forward 40, right 90 again. Okay, and then uh, forward 180. And then we'll end the fill. Okay, and then the last thing we want to do here is we want to go uh, right 180 again. So have a look at that. Maybe draw it out and just um, see, draw it out on a piece of paper and see what shape you think we're going to get. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this and just paste it again. And then I'm going to paste it again. And I'm going to change the black to a different color. So I'm going to go red. And down here, I'm going to go yellow. OK. And then what I want to do is um, right at the bottom, I'm going to add the command exit on click. OK. Says it will exit on click, and then let's test that, and we'll see what we've got. Okay, perfect. So we've got our black, our red, and our yellow, and we've got our German flag. So what we're then going to do is, because I put that exit on click, I can just exit it. And if you just look through each of these blocks of text, you should be able to work out what it's doing. So setting the color to black, begin fill, moving forward, turning right, moving forward, turning right forward, ending the fill and turning right, getting ready to draw the next uh, the next sort of shape. So really, really easy and quick to do. Have a go yourselves and see how you get on. If you uh, do enjoy this, you can um, try and challenge yourself a little bit. So I'll show you a couple of other things you could look to do. So this is the US flag, so I'll run this one. Now, as you can see, there's quite a lot of detail in this. And I know what you're thinking. You're thinking the stars don't quite, quite look right. But once it finishes the first pass, it will start to add in the extra stars. As you can see there. Okay, so I'm going to close that one off. Um, you could have a go with uh, this one, something like this, the Olympic rings, the Olympic flag. Um, or you could do something completely unrelated to flags. So quite a nice little effect using iteration uh, within the and using some of the turtle commands. It's quite a really nice geometric sort of pattern. 
Okay, so that's the sort of things you can do with it. Um, read the documentation. Um, it does. It will give you a lot of ideas on what to do. So the documentation for Python. I'll put a link in the description below. I'll also try to link to the the files that I've done. The German flag, US flag. Um, and sort of Olympic rings and the the color shape uh, so you've actually got the code files to be the Python files to be able to have a look at the code and see see how these have been done um, yeah and just have fun with it you know it's just something new to try uh, do remember to uh, like subscribe and share it really helps me out and if you do want um, some tutorials or you've got an idea for a tutorial you'd like me to do please drop me a line on Twitter um, link will be on the screen. This has been Fun With Flags.